As the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission MACC heightens efforts to combat graft, politicians from all divides must have faith and confidence in the commissions to accomplish the task entrusted to them. Former Independent a Commission Against Corruption of Hong Kong ICSE Commissioner Bertrand Despeville stressed that the commission should be allowed to get on with the job of implementing national anti-corruption strategies without having to encounter any political interference. It is for the annual report of the anti-corruption body, as is done here, to be presented to the parliamentarians and the parliamentarians may then ask the anti-corruption body questions arising from the report. But that does not mean that the politicians should take the opportunity to start second-guessing the anti-corruption body about particular investigations. If they start to do that, I'm afraid they undermine the independence and the operational autonomy of the anti-corruption body, and they will uh, serve the country ill by doing that. Praising the MECC for being accountable to representatives of the public, this bill noted that it is essential for the Commission to have friends in the local communities. He pointed out that the anti-corruption advisory board members serves as ambassadors to the public as their first-hand witnesses to the initiatives taken by the Commission. In my view, advisory committees, well you have your parliamentary committee, I'll leave that to one side, but the advisory committees that work with the Commission um, and get close up to the work of the Commission, they are invaluable. Uh, not only as a source of advice to the Commission, <coughs> but also as the check and balance that you've referred to. They monitor on behalf of the community what the Commission is doing. They can see that the Commission is doing a good job. Um, it's very important that the Commission should have friends in the community, should have ambassadors who can go out and say, we know about this Commission, we see them doing their work close up. We can tell you that they do a thorough job. That's very important from your point of view because it helps to develop and sustain public support for what you're doing. And public support is one of the essentials for success against corruption. There are just seven essentials. Public support is one of them. If you don't have public support, you cannot win the fight. It is one of the essentials of success in the fight against corruption. I'm afraid it's silly to pretend that you can beat what everybody thinks in this country is a serious problem unless you put substantial resources into that fight. It's like any major problem that you would have. Uh, resources are needed. It's not enough to have fine plans and great words. You have to back it up with resources.